All right, hi everybody. Welcome back to Tech Tips TV. So, as you can probably tell, I am currently sitting in my truck bed um, because I'm going to do a custom project and I needed to get some of the tools that I have in here and it's easier to just do it in here. But, so basically, I have a case for my desktop. I have a, a Corsair 750D, uh, it's a full tower, and it has slots for two and a half inch uh, SATA drives. However, I don't really like where they are and they're made they're there so that you know you can display the drives but I'm going to display it even better so I have right here I have a piece of uh, I think it's aluminum uh, zinc coated aluminum is what it is uh, but so I'm going to take this I've already cut it down to size um, but now I'm going to do I'm going to finish off I'm going to drill out the holes so that I can mount the drives onto it and then I'm going to figure out how exactly I'm going to go about mounting it in my case because I haven't figured that out part out yet all right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a uh, nail, nail, nail punch, that's what it's called, couldn't remember it. And all of these um, crosses where these lines meet are the holes, so I'm just gonna punch it out so I have a center to go off when I go to drill the holes. So, I'm gonna do that quick. Next, I'm going to take the drill. I'm going to go probably an eighth of an inch. Should be enough. I'll probably go a little bit bigger. Actually, you know what? Let's go. Because truthfully, it doesn't matter. Um, as long as the screws are able to hold the drive in which is really the main goal. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's not like it's screwing into the aluminum. It's, the screw is only just gonna go through the aluminum into the, uh, into the drive. So now I'm going to just use this file to remove all these burrs here. I don't have anything else really to use, so I'm just going to use this. This is all I have. Okay, so I had to make a quick run to Home Depot. I'm actually about to go in right now. This is going to be really weird because there's a lot of people here and I'm going to seem like I'm talking to myself as I'm walking through Home Depot, but I guess that's what we're going to do. So, here we go. So, apparently there was something wrong with that paint can. So, hopefully they have... Oh, they do. Alright, cool. So... Ooh. Hmm. Um, let's see. I wish they had a matte black instead of a satin. I'm not a huge fan of the satin. But it doesn't look like matte black exists. Under coming. I should get that at some point. Hmm. Satin, 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 satin. It's all fucking satin. Why is it all satin? Oh, flat. Here we go. Black flat. So. There, right there. Ooh, it's got the nice cover thing. All right, we're going to go with this one. All right, so I decided to just repaint the whole thing. So... Let me just shake this can up, and then we'll get going. So 
So again, since it's symmetrical, I just flipped it over, and it is exactly the same. Oh, perfect. All right, I like this. This is good. All right, here we go. Alright, so it's really cold out here, because this is Maine, and it's November, and it's cold. So, that's it, and we'll finish this up in my room. Alright, um, so I've decided to let it dry a little bit more. Um, I don't want to ruin the paint yet, so I'm going to let it uh, cure probably overnight before I actually go ahead and touch it and put the drives on. Um, there was a little bit of a problem but it's okay because I'll just flip it upside down. The uh, Some of the holes actually aren't um, the right distance. I don't know how that happened because all the other ones are correct, um, but no big deal. I'm not going to have it covered with all four drives. Eventually, I'm only going to have two drives on it, um, so it's not too big of a deal. Uh, but it came out awesome. I'm really happy with it. Uh, now I just got to figure out how I'm going to mount it in there. Um, but I'll figure that out on another day. So, I'm really happy with how it came out. Uh, I think it's going to look awesome once I get it into the case. Uh, it's going to be able to display the drives even that much better, especially with the solid state drives. So, that's going to be awesome. Um, as always, if you like the video, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you want to know any of the tools that I use during the process or the paint that I used as well, just leave a comment down below and I'll be sure to, to answer uh, to what I used. So thank you as always and I'll see you next time.